All right, to begin, I just added a video clip to my timeline along with the regular text clip from the effects library, which I dragged above it. Before we continue, you wanna make sure your text is typed and formatted exactly how you want it because you won't be able to edit it after we do the next step. I recommend dragging it from the timeline into the media pool to make a copy of it in case you wanna change it later on. Okay, now once you have your regular text clip on your timeline, right click it, and select New Compound Clip. You can name yours if you like, I'll just leave mine alone. Then in the Effects Library, select Open Effects, and scroll down to the bottom where you'll find the Camera Shake effect. Drag it onto your Compound Clip on the timeline. Okay, there we have a shake on our text, but it's not nearly fast enough. To edit the shake, go over to the Inspector, and select the Open Effects tab. The main things you'll want to change in here are these first three settings. I suggest increasing the motion scale a decent amount so your text moves around a larger area in your frame. Then increase the speed scale all the way up to make your text shake faster. And you may want to give it some motion blur to make the shake look more cinematic. Okay, that's looking better, but it's still not moving as fast as I'd like it to. To make it move really fast, you want to increase the PTR speed in the next section. I like how this looks now, so I'll leave it at that. I wanted to make this guide uncomplicated for beginners, but you can definitely play around with the other settings. For example, increasing the rotation amplitude will make it shake more on a swivel, which looks really good to me. Alright, and that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.